Hi, Super Spruce here, back with another Ordinal Marker video, episode 58. And it's been a few days since episode 57. I've grinded enough decremeni to get my singularity up to a level 144. So I think that's pretty good. I think hopefully I don't I don't think I have enough cardinals here. Yeah, I don't I don't have enough cardinals to get to 145, but that'll happen in a few days. But yeah, hopefully this singularity level will allow me to do a lot more. So I maybe I'm just gonna exit the Omega Challenge. I'm not really sure what I should do at this point because I I feel like I should just keep doing Omega Challenges at this point. Like just one plus two because now that my singularity is just so much better, and since I know like I should probably be, probably be trying to grind some factor boosts out, I'll be I should be able to. Can I, can I not factor boost? I, I can get these, but why can't I factor boost? Hello? It says the factor boost auto procedure is on. Um, what? I'm gonna reload. Oh wait, I don't have these? No, I have these. I'm gonna reload. Oh wait, this is factor shift, not factor boost. What am I doing? But even even says the factor shift auto procedure is on. I don't know what's what's up with this. It's probably one of these challenges. Yeah, it's the challenges. Well, okay. I, I guess I'm just gonna get deeper. Any I, it's it's been a while since I did this. I, I don't know why I'm. I just I can't find anything. Where is where is the decrement incrementy? Here it is E92. Is that good? Yeah, that's good. That's more completions. So, I don't know. Okay, I should not have been panicking there. I'm just going to go to Omega Challenge 3 and actually get factor boosts there. doesn't look like I'm getting that many. It's only 123 per second, perhaps. No, it's not because I because I, I can't get any boosters. Let's see. If I, if I go into incrementing here, I should be able to, um, like, after grinding just a little bit of factor boosts, it's not really that much. Actually, once I get this, I can grind a lot more factor boosts. Just get this. Now it is 31,000 per second. So just grinding a bit. Maybe I can just get up to about around a million or so. And once I get to a million, then I can I can go. All right, I only need to get to a million, but I'm just gonna turn off the factor boost auto procedure. I'm gonna level up the singularity. Up until the point where I can't get any more incrementy, look here and see that I have some more Omega Challenge completions. So I don't think this is really doing all that much. It's only it's gonna make this left column of of booster upgrades cheaper. It doesn't even seem all that useful. It's only one, two, five, four now. So I don't see how much cheaper it's gonna be able to get. It's better just just for the completions, and I could try. Omega Challenge 5. I don't think I've done that one recently. So that's what I will do. Omega Challenge 5. Um, I, of course, I'm, uh, before I do anything, I want to get these. Because I know Omega Challenge 5 is a little trickier. And I probably need to turn, need to turn this back on. And, oh yeah, this is where you need to just, just mark up a few times manually. I think... I'm stuck in base 7, I have 16 ordinal points, is it not doing anything? It's not doing anything. It's only 307 um, ordinal points to factor shift though. I, I'm not even reading the descriptions of these anymore, it's just all the power multiplier is stuck at 0.01. Well, okay, I guess I just, I guess I need to grind to 100 ordinal points. It's a shame that I need to do that, but I'll do that. And maybe I can get away with this. Yeah, I can get away with that because I already had like 20. So, okay. It, it's, it's lame that I have to do this every time. But at least it's a little easier to get 100. I, I now just need Omega cubed plus Omega times, squared times 2. And it looks like I just got 25 factor boost and I need to do the whole thing again. I don't think I want to do the whole thing again, so I'm, I'm going to turn on um, 
off the factor boost auto procedure. Because it's lame to just do the whole the same thing over and over again. So there will be a time where I can get 100 ordinal points just from getting Omega Cubed in this challenge. So let's see. And here we go. 100 ordinal points. Do this in base 6. I'm going to just try to click so I can do this faster. 100 ordinal points, base 5, base, base 3. And now I want to increase the singularity level um, just to see how much increment I can get per second. It's about E61. Let's see if that's enough to... That is enough to get a few more completions of the challenge. So E63 incrementing will allow me to get stronger all of power. It's not all that much more, at least I don't think. Um, I mean, this challenge, it's nothing, but even outside of this challenge, I don't think it's going to be that big of a deal. And I could try to go into Omega Challenge 2. I feel like I really grinded that. The same with Omega Challenge 4. So I don't think I should be doing that. Instead, let's see. I don't know. Maybe I should just go for incrementing because my singularity is, is like... 12 levels higher than the last time I I went for that, so that's what I'm gonna do. I need to grind factor boosts, unfortunately. Uh, it's outside of any Omega Challenge, but it's still grinding factor boosts. So, let's see, auto procedure, get this. Am I still in the Omega Challenge even though I clicked exit? Yes, I'm still in the Omega Challenge. Or I'm something, or there's a bug. I'm gonna reload. Okay, that was a bug. So, I'm re I've reloaded. I'm going to get a ton of factor boost per second. I'm already at 1.6 billion at singularity level 39. That's a good sign because I know I can get it all the way up to like around 100 or near 100. It's now 5 billion every second. That's it's over doubled last time. So, that'll allow me if I especially if I keep getting more factor boosts. That's going to allow me to hit a quadrillion if I wait two days. That plus just how much better the... Um, how, how much better the singularity level is for incrementy. Because I have so many... I have so much more manifolds now that I can make use of. Which will just allow me to just do so much more. And it will allow me to get more singularity levels. And... Yeah, I don't think there's much else I can do. I think I just want to keep pushing singularity levels. So, yeah, see you in a bit. Okay, I'm back a week later. Yes, a week later. 3.7 quadrillion factor boosts. That is a good time to try to do challenge 9 and try to get more incrementy. Or actually, first I've kind of ignored this. I now have enough Aleph Omega here. Like, if I convert into Aleph Omega, I can get an extra Singularity level. So, yeah, 1.4 E42. Actually, I'm not sure that's... Qu no, I need 1.43 E42. So, that means I can get one more Singularity level. Just helps slightly. And then I could actually go into Challenge 9. And, I mean, I, I'm, there's no more Baseless Milestones for me to conquer. So, I think really the only thing for me to do is... Challenge 9 and then get Cardinals. So, Challenge 9. Um, of course, I need to, need to do this. I need to do all the... I need to just get to the Batman Howard Ordinal first. And then once I reach there, I can get a lot of Incrementy. So, let's see. I'm getting E173, 174, 170. Actually, I can just do this. E179, it's really actually E... 164 incrementing, but that's still a lot. And actually, yeah, it's automatically getting all these incrementing upgrades. Which means, let's see how many manifolds I can get. One. That's not a single manifold? Really? thought I was going to be able to get a lot more than that. Hmm. I really thought I was... Or maybe it's automatically giving me them. Yeah. So, like, my max singularity is now 153. So... Now, that's way higher than the 145 I got after I got this. So, that means it's, it's definitely a success. I mean, I'm not exactly sure what a level 153 singularity would really do, but 
At least I have that. Maybe it, it'll be good for Omega Challenges. And I feel like I should really focus on Omega Challenges at this point. So, what I'm going to do, I will exit Challenge 9. Could try to do Challenge 8 to get another Challenge 8 completion. That is another thing to focus on. So, actually, I will try that. I know I keep trying that over and over and over again. But maybe this time will be different. I now have a much higher singularity than before. And I can also get, like, this. And... Maybe, actually it didn't really need to decrim anyone, but maybe if I get, if I downgrade it to level 1, I can get it's E47, which is not quite enough, even with this. I mean, I could factor shift, I could try to reach, um, reach in base 3, except I do need the E44 ordinal points. I can't really get, so, I, and I, I'm, I really, I think I just need more Omega Challenge completions. I keep trying this and never actually getting anywhere, but at least it's, at least I'm trying, I don't know. So I'm just going to exit the challenge and collapse normally, because this will give me a ton of Cardinals. Um, I mean, not, not this one, but the next one. So I'm going to do this, and then E40 Cardinals. Um, so yeah, I'm not sure if, if I wait, it'll be actually faster, but... I'll just do this. E40 Cardinals, that means I'm going to get over 100 times as many Cardinals as I was before, which will just help everything. And I feel like I should just, just now focus on um, Omega Challenges. So, I feel like I just keep trying these over and over again. Every episode, just trying to see what I can do. Maybe the Singularity, since it's a little higher, I can get slightly better. Like, if I do 1 in 2, let's see how much I can get with this. So, if I... I probably want to, yeah, want to get this. want to turn off the factor boost auto procedure. Or, no, it's not even that. It's just it's just trying to get the completions. Not getting any completions. Is it because... Oh, of course. At this point, I could try to just max it, but I don't want to waste like, stuff on useless... Actually, that's kind of useless for this challenge. I could just refund and... Just, like, do this. That's really all I need. Actually, no, I, this is, this one is useful. So, this should help me get a few more completions. If I go down to Singularity 1, let's, let's see if I'm getting anything. It's giving me something, but it's not really a lot. I mean, I guess it's something. But, it's like 0.08 challenge completions. That's not that's not significant. I think I really I think Omega Challenge Two, maybe time to try that again. So I I mean, there first is the factor boost grinding that I did do a crazy amount of before, but maybe I don't need this now, or maybe just with this I can grind more factor boost. Yeah, two million per second. That's really good. And now if I turn off the auto procedure, let's see let's see how much I can do now. Hopefully, it's something. Um, it's about E100 incrementing. So, is this... It is, actually. That, that's actually a decent amount. Of, you know, that's about 0.15 challenge completions, giving me about plus 0.014 to... 015, actually, to this doubling, which is pretty good, actually. But I'm not exactly sure how good that is. Maybe it's only about 10 times incrementing multiplier. I could try to grind in this challenge. I mean, again, I, that's what I'll probably do. Because I really do... I think that this is really going to help all other challenge completions. And maybe I should just go into 1 and 8, actually. Because I got a bunch of singularity levels. I mean, I, I, I went into this very recently. But maybe it's, it's enough. I, I really don't know. So, that's what I will do. I, I keep just doing these. I feel like I, I do these multiple times in an episode. But, maybe it's, maybe it's not that case. If I get this... Yeah, and there's, of course, I need to get the booster upgrades. And then maybe the booster upgrades can actually help me. Because there is, there is this. The markup gives more... If I do this, I can actually now get that upgrade, which 
I'm not sure if it's going to do a lot. For whatever reason, I can't... Okay, there we go. So it's E54 ordinal points. And maybe, that, I feel like that's... Maybe it's enough to get that Omega to the Omega squared in this challenge, but maybe it's not. If I go check the dark upgrades, let's see... Uh, hmm, that's not very good. It's I'm getting about... At this point, it's like E58 per second. I'm probably going to get one singularity level if I wait 24 hours. That's not really what I was going for. Maybe I should try to factor shift because now I'm getting much more ordinal points in challenge 8. So maybe if I enter the right tab, if I try to factor shift, um, maybe this will do something because I can not quite reach 70, 44 ordinal points. I'm extremely close. That makes me think that I should try to enter Omega Challenge 4 because I'm so close. 70, 44 versus 3, E44. So maybe this is what I need. So back when Howard Ordinal um, could try to first just grind some factor boosts. So giving me, he's even giving me a lot. Well, first, of course, I need to do this. And then let's see how much it's giving me. Yeah, it's a million factor boosts every second. So that's probably good factor boost grinding. And then once I turn this back off, let's see if I can actually get more incrementing out of this. So let's see, 108, 110. But 115 is the max. Is this going to do anything? It does. Not that much. But it may be that crucial bit I actually need to just put me over the edge. If I can just get this to 0 0.440, actually even this may be enough because um, this is like 2E44. So it's extremely, it's doing almost nothing, yet it's doing everything. It's, it's weird. So I feel like that is the key to progressing much, much, much farther. So... Yeah, I I'm I feel like I can just exit this Omega Challenge at this point. So now I'm gonna try one and eight again. One, eight, and then we'll get the same build I had before. First, yeah, singularity one. Just get get everything at this point. Um except I guess I can get that. Um because it costs nothing. And base five, just do this. Um, of course, get the booster upgrades. I'm not sure if I can get any, if I have any more boosters than before. It seems about, the, it seems exactly the same. So, if I just mark up here and get, it's the same E54 as before, but once I get this, really? Oh my god! Why did this change? I could get more ordinal points before. That's actually really frustrating me. Maybe I need to grind decrementing first? This makes no sense. Am I... It's not auto-clickers. I need 1.43 E44. Yet, for whatever reason now, I can only get 1.3... 1.37 E44. Honestly, I feel like that just comes out of weird quirks from this. Because I swear I had 3 E44 before. So, that's what I'll do. I will first get these. Maybe then I'll get the singularity stuff. So base 5, just get everything. Maybe I should just get as many ordinal points as possible. I'm just trying to max everything. I'm not even sure. I'm really... Maybe I shouldn't even get the decrim anyone. Because maybe it's just that close. Because I don't really want to get decrim any. Like if I could just get this. Like E43, E53. For whatever reason, I can't get as much as I had before. This is so weird. Now it's only E43. This makes zero sense. Maybe this does something? Oh yeah, that does give me the 1.37 E44. I'm just gonna go back into the other challenge. This is extremely annoying, how inconsistent this challenge is. Okay, I'm back in this challenge, and I've got this down. I'm being safe. This is now down to 
Zero point four three eight. That's about. That's probably something like eight e forty three. That's all I'm gonna need. Hopefully that's enough. I'm really hoping that <laughs> that the curse that happened last time is not gonna happen this time. I also have one additional booster, which may be. <laughs> That, that actually may be crucial. I am I really have no idea. I'm just going to use the same build as I had before with this. Just get everything. And um, let's see. So E54 as before. Get the factor shift. And boom. There it is. E114 ordinal points in challenge 8. Which means another huge breakthrough in just everything. So... Ton more dark manifolds. This means if I go into singularity, you'll see that next episode. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out.